I was debating on whether I was even going to make this. I don't make political posts a lot, but this one just kind of set on me today. I'm over here helping some people out cleaning some chicken houses out. They needed an extra truck to haul the chicken litter from the chicken houses to the barn, the stack house, and I'm in my old dump truck. Anyway, so I had to go top off this morning. I had three quarters of the tank, two thirds of the tank, cost me hundred dollars in fuel to top off. I'm over here, uh, cleaning chicken litter out. Well, we need chicken litter to put on our corn fields, our hay fields, cow pastures. You can't afford fertilizer right now, just twelve hundred dollars a ton, and uh, that's just nitrogen. That's not a full-on fertilizer. So we. Bought a chicken litter spreader truck this year started spreading chicken litter. Well, it's expensive too, but not near as bad as what commercial fertilizer is. Well, I got thinking about this. I'm over here today in my truck, burning my fuel, not getting paid, except we're getting a discount on chicken litter. Which my daddy's running a chicken litter truck right now spreading chicken litter. So, what all does this mean? I paid $5.19 a gallon this morning for fuel. These other boys out here, they're paying the same for the fuel they're running in their equipment to clean these chicken houses out. So if you want to know why your prices of chicken and pork and beef are going up like they are, it ain't got nothing to do with us. See, what we're doing right now is we're helping each other out. I'm over here working for free, running my truck for free, well, for a discount on chicken litter. So it makes it a little bit more affordable on them it also makes it a little bit more affordable on us. So when you buy from us, from a local farmer who does stuff like this, and you get a better price for a better product than what you give at the store, it ain't cause it's cheap to do. It's cause we work harder for it and we put more pride and love in what we do and we pass it on to our consumers. So y'all think about that this Independence Day weekend. This country was built by a bunch of people who wanted the best for the country as a whole. And it was individuals, it wasn't a government that did that. Y'all remember that. Buy local and happy Independence Day, y'all.